For this video, we are going to focus on adding captions or subtitles to our iMovie Slideshow project. So here I am back in the project library. So I'm going to click back on my Achilles project because that's what I'm working with. And this is going to be similar to how we created our title slide. So what I need to do is, you know, figure out which one of these I would like to add some text to. Now you might want to add text to a particular slide or image just to give your viewer some context as to what they're looking at or maybe emphasize a key point, whatever that might be. So uh, again, I want to come down to where my browsers are and I'm going to click on the T for the titles browser. Again, this is the same thing that we used when we created our title slide. So I look through my titles browser and see which one of these I would like uh, to use for creating a caption. So I'll just pick one of these and what you want to do is you want to drag it up and actually drop it directly on top of the image. You notice how it kind of gets a little uh, blue tint to the image. You can see the little plus sign there. So if I just drop it right on there, you now see that above the image, above the slide, you now have uh, something there to tell you that you have some text available for this slide. How I add the text is I uh, come over here to the right and I can type directly into uh, the image and right into the text. So here uh, it offers like a title text and then a subtitle underneath. That's just the, the template that I use. There's lots of different ones uh, in the menu to choose, but I can simply type uh, and if you click it'll highlight. I can type anything that I want right in here. And there it is. If you want to see what it would look like, again, remember you can come up here and hit the space bar and you can get a preview and it shows you exactly what that would look like. Uh, also, uh, you can select both of these. You could select the image if you need to do something with the image or if you click above on the little blue box, there you can uh, use and mess with the text. You can mess with the fonts. You got font, color, and size here that you can uh, change if, if you want. You can hit play to get a preview and when you are finished you just click done. Then you can go to another image and say for instance you would like to give this image some context and I can pick you know alright I'll pick a different one for this one. Uh, let's, uh, let's try this one. We'll do the torn edge. Drop it right on there and then add my text right in. And there we have it. Say done when I'm done. And you can see that that text is going to show up in those particular images. So that's how we add subtitles or add captions. Uh, I would encourage you to do that to give some context to your images for your audience.